Ospreys. I'm Rhett Berenger, and welcome to your Swift Spotlight. Let's get into the news. Opposition leader Alexei Navalny's mother has filed a lawsuit at a court in the city of Slackhart, according to state news agency TASS. Court officials have said a closed-door hearing has been set for March 4th. And on Tuesday, Naval Naya attempted to reach out to Russian President Vladimir Putin, saying in a video, quote, I'm reaching out to you, Vladimir Putin. The resolution of this matter depends solely on you. Let me finally see my son, end quote. Members of Navalny's team say, said authorities say the cause of death is still unknown and will not release his body for the next two weeks. American lawyers argued before a British High Court Wednesday that WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange should face espionage charges in the United States because he went beyond journalism in his attempt to solicit, steal, and indiscriminately publish classified U.S. government documents, endangering innocent lives. Assange's lawyers argued earlier that American authorities are seeking to punish Assange for the leak's, quote, exposure of criminality on the part of the U.S. government on an unprecedented scale, end quote, including tortures and killings. Moving east, the South Korean government warned thousands of striking doctors to work immediately or face legal action on Wednesday. About 7,800 medical interns and residents walked off their jobs in protest of a new government push to increase the na nationwide medical school admissions cap by 2,000 for the next year. The government is planning to increase the cap to brace for South Korea's aging population. However, some doctors are refuting the plan, saying the universities aren't ready to offer quality education to that many students. Well, Ospreys, this has been your Soup Spotlight. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.